Welcome to the demonstration of PD6000 Pro Breath Analyzer by Subtronics. We shall now show you the contents of the box packing by unpacking it. PD6000 Pro is basically packed in a compact box. The contents are, it contains the main instrument that is PD6000 Pro. On unveiling the package, you can see there is an operation instruction manual which de deeply describes the whole operation of the instrument which we will now demonstrate to you. It also contains a compact battery charger for charging the instrument. This charger needs to be plugged in 230. The socket is to be plugged in the instrument. And the last content is a small test bottle which is required to test the operation of the PD6000 Pro instrument. We will now demonstrate the indicators of the PD6000 Pro model to you. Beginning off with the on and off switch as you can see. Uh, this switch switches on the instrument and switches off the instrument. It's a push to on push to off switch. The second switch is the reset switch. This in uh, switch would be used while resetting the alarm once the alarm is set. Starting off with the socket, uh, the indicator level. This is a tri status indicator that is the same light shows you the three status. First is the yellow LED. It will turn yellow when the instrument is in the maturity mode that is in the initial timer mode. The same indicator would turn flashing green and it would start flashing green indicating that the instrument is on and ready to use. In case the alarm is detected the same indicator would turn red and start flashing along with the audio alarm. Starting with the sockets I would like to introduce you the charging socket which is shown by the charging symbol indicator. The charging socket would be plugged into the charging socket in this position and it would be indicated by the confirmation indicator showing glowing red once it's charging. Secondly, I would like to show you the low battery indicator. This indicator would glow red if the batteries are low and the instrument requires charging. Lastly but not the least, the master reset of the instrument. This instrument is a highly sophisticated microprocessor based instrument and would require if it hangs would require to reset manually which should be done using a pin to be put into the socket and pressing the switch inside. This is not required very often, it's a rare case, in case the instrument hangs you can reset it very easily. So moving on to the operation of the instrument next. We will now show you how to operate the instrument. Switch on the instrument using the on off switch. Once you switch it on, there will be a beep which will be heard and the indicator will turn yellow stating that it's in the timer mode. Once in the timer mode, the indicator turns yellow stating that it is the sensor is getting matured and it is now will be ready for the next test when the same indicator will turn green. Till it turns green, I will tell you how to conduct the test. Basically to conduct the test, this is the sensing portion where the subject has to exhale his lung deep air which we will be soon showing you and the indication will appear on the indicator. The indicator would turn red to indicate that there is a alcohol contents detected in the breath of the subject. Once it gets in ready, you will observe that the instrument will start beeping and the same indicator would start turning green and start flashing. Green flashes indicate that the instrument is ready for operation. Please use the instrument only after the flashes start green. As you observe, it just beeped and it started to flash green. This indicates that the instrument is now ready for operation and can start conducting test. To conduct the test, simply ask the person to exhale lung deep air onto the sensing portion for, for, from a distance of 5 cm for at least 6 seconds. We will now ask a subject to demonstrate it to you. Here it goes. Okay. That's how the test is conducted. In case there is an alarm or the level of alcohol is detected, any traces of alcohol are detected in the subject under test, then the instrument would be prayed. We will just show you a demonstration using the test bottle. 
this is how the instrument would go red the indicator would turn red and it will start flashing in the end along with the audio indication in order to reset the instrument simply press the reset switch as shown here and the instrument will reset and start flashing green back again which indicates that it's ready for the next test the indicator on the left which you can focus on there's a small battery indicator which is shown this indicates that the instrument battery is low and would turn red indicating the instrument needs charging we would recommend you to charge the instrument at least for 3 hours before the next test caution should be taken that the person should not spit into the sensing portion of the instrument this is the sensing portion of the instrument and it's very critical it is the heart of the instrument it, the user must not put any liquid solvents or any fumes or vapors directly onto this sensing portion care must be taken to switch off the instrument simply press the on off switch once again and the instrument would turn off the instrument turning off would be indicated by the closure of the led indicator now indicating that the instrument is turned on thank you for the demonstration and have a great day